The inflation impact on grocery prices is outstanding, and many families are feeling the pinch uh, as soon as they go shopping. So we took some time to talk to an expert today about how to save. In this war on inflation, family meal prep can be a great ally. And Chef is going to show us how $70 of ingredients can make three meals for a family of four. A lemon herb roasted tilapia with some roasted vegetables and a rice pilaf, stir fry beef, chicken and dumplings, we went ahead and utilized the chicken breast. Eric Deason is the executive chef at Papa Joe's Market in Rochester Hills. We spent the afternoon walking through how you can feed your whole family on less ingredients and less money. So you went downstairs and Papa Joe's picked up all of this, and this is $70. $70, yeah, and I got three full meals here that I was able to prepare. Now mind you, there's still some odds and end things that you might need, like there's salt, pepper, garlic. And preparation is the real key to paying less. When you plan out like that, you're only getting the products you need, not things you think you might want or need. No, you already know because you have your list, you're all set, you're ready to go there. And don't shop when you're hungry. No, oh, never ever shop when you're hungry. That's <laughs> the worst. You'll walk out the whole store. But if you do take that few minutes to prepare yeah. early in the week, then it can stretch through the whole week, including Absolutely. your dollar. Absolutely. Like you kind of laid out some things yeah, so, that we can do all week. So what I did here is I took three different meals that I can prepare, and I thought about it, and I'm like, all right, so I got this chicken and dumpling recipe that I love, okay. I want to prepare, so I'm going to need carrot, celery, onion for it. And I was like, all right, I want some roasted vegetables with a fish dish and maybe some rice. So I was like, okay, well, I can use my celery, carrots, and onions that I got. I can use that to make my rice peel off to go with my fish. Mm. And then, hmm, roasted vegetables. Well, if I'm gonna do roasted vegetables, I can make a stir fry too. So let me get some beef while I'm at it. And now I can cross utilize all these, the squash, my broccoli, I can use this for the roasted vegetables and cross utilize it for my beef dish. So that way, all these different vegetables I'm getting, I'm using for a couple of different Three dishes. Three different dishes. Instead of trying to buy like, oh, I'm just gonna get chicken and dumplings and then I'm gonna make, you know, uh, fried chicken with yeah. mashed potatoes. Like I'm not, no. not utilizing products that way, you know? And now I'm not having to buy more and more things. By planning out those three meals and realizing the different things I can do with these things, I'm saving my dollars by buying the same product. And that's so smart, Chef. You know, yeah. to plan the same vegetables and protein for different dishes. Right. A whole week's worth of food out of that $70 bundle. Yeah. Chicken and dumplings. Chef, oh, I'm, I can't wait. Oh my God. Good? Amazing. <laughs> I wish I could come here every day to eat. <laughs> <laughs> well, buckle up because the end is not in sight yet. As we go further into 2022, prices are not done rising. Economists are predicting another 1% to 2% jump this year before a drop-off begins. So if you can plan smart, um, you can have a meal that lasts all week.